In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Welcome to the month of October. The month of October is a month, first week of this great month, which is the month of the Most Holy Rosary. We start off with some really great saints. We celebrate the feast day of St. Therese. Here you can see a picture of her. St. Therese of Lisieux is the saint that we celebrate on October 1st every year. October 2nd, we celebrate the feast day of the guardian angels. Just last week, September 29th, we celebrated three archangels that we talked about. St. Michael the Archangel, the Prince of the Heavenly Hosts, patron of soldiers, and all of us are soldiers for Christ. The Archangel Gabriel, the patron of modern communication. May his presence, his prayers, help us to communicate better. And St. Raphael, which means God heals, the angelic doctor, the patron of so many things, but of courtships and marriages and purity and joy, happy meetings, travelers. What a wonderful angel saint. So today we celebrate the feast day of St. Therese of Lisieux, October 2nd, we celebrate the Feast Day of the Guardian Angels. October 4th, we celebrate the Feast Day of one of the greatest saints in the Catholic Church, and that is the great St. Francis of Assisi. Then, on October 7th, we celebrate the Feast Day of Our Lady of the Rosary in honor of the victory in Lepanto in the 16th century, in which the Catholic Christian fleet, the Navy, defeated the Ottoman Turks or the Muslims through the intercession of Our Lady and many people praying the rosary. One word on St. Therese today. She is one of the most famous modern saints and her pathway to holiness is for us. It is basically this. She said she couldn't do great sacrifices and sufferings like the saints of the past. But her pathway to holiness was this. To try to do the ordinary things of daily life with extraordinary love. That's the secret. If you and me. We can strive to do the ordinary things of our daily life. Carrying out our, our vocation in life. Carrying out the ordinary things of our daily life with extraordinary love. That is the secret of holiness. That is the secret of sanctification. That is the secret of our salvation. So may St. Therese of Lisieux. Bless you with her prayers this day. Amen.